What's up world, it's Dallas with Gadget Hacks, and today I'm going to show you how to enable normal boot animation changing on a Galaxy S5. Now most Android devices allow you to simply replace a zip file in your system slash media folder if you want to change your boot animation. This isn't the case for the Galaxy S5 though, as it's been obfuscated somehow in Samsung's TouchWiz. But if you have a custom recovery installed on your device, enabling normal Android behavior in this regard is as simple as flashing one file. This zip comes courtesy of XDA users and Beck and Pilot. And we've got a direct link to the file over at the full tutorial. So head to the link in the description below to download that. And I've also got a nice set of custom boot animations over there to get you started. But with Flashable Zip downloaded, the next step is to boot into your custom recovery. The process of booting into custom recovery is slightly different depending on which variant of the GS5 that you own. For the AT&T or Verizon variants, start by rebooting your phone. After the Samsung Galaxy S5 powered by Android logo, just tap Recovery to enter Safe Strap. For all other variants, simply power off your phone, then press and hold the volume up, home, and power buttons simultaneously. But no matter how you get into recovery, the next step is to head to the install function. From here, browse to the download folder on your internal SD card to locate the CWM custom boot animation zip file that you downloaded from the tutorial. Go ahead and tap it, then swipe the slider at the bottom to get it installed. If you're using Clockwork Mod or Phil's Touch, you just have to press Install here. But when that's done, go ahead and reboot your phone. When you get back up, changing boot animations is as simple as putting a file into a folder and naming it properly. So use any of the links over at the full tutorial to download the boot animation that looks best to you. After you've done that, open up your favorite root-enabled file browser and head to the download folder of your internal SD card. From here, go ahead and copy the boot animation zip file that you downloaded. Next, browse to the root directory of your device, aka the highest folder that you can navigate to in the folder tree. Once you're here, head to the system folder, then browse to the media folder inside of that. Next, just be sure this folder is mounted as read-write, so that you can make changes to the files in here. With that done, simply paste your boot animation file into this folder. From here, long press the file and rename it to bootanimation.zip. With that out of the way, Make sure that the permissions on this file are set to read and write in the owner category, while all other categories are set to just read. Now, all that's left to do is to reboot your phone so that you can check out your new boot animation. Going forward, if you'd like to change your boot animation again in the future, just replace that boot animation.zip file with your new one. It's as simple as that. But for the full breakdown, be sure to check out my article at the link in the description below. And as always, we'd appreciate it if you would like and comment on this video and subscribe to our channel. So we'll see you again next time, folks, but until then, happy gadget hacking.